children. I hope we all gain worldliness and wisdom and maturity, but I hope most of all that my space falls into obscurity. <laughs> I hope our profiles all go dead, entombed in distant servers, a monument to our youth, although lacking its observers. Your page will be an empty shell when no one is behind it. I hope your MySpace stays forever. And I hope your children find it. And I hope that you forget about your MySpace. I hope it's completely from your mind. And I hope it stays up long enough for the next generation to find. And I hope that it embarrasses your children. Or that they're ready for the forward and around. And I hope that you forget your password so you cannot take it down. But when I sing it now, it just reminds me that I'm aging. <laughs> the sense moved on, of course, to Facebook and to Twitter. And MySpace was some bygone thing we'd never reconsider. Folks used to get in my DMs, bemused and yet conflicted. They could not find their MySpace login, just as I predicted. But then last March, the story broke of a massive server error. Twelve years of my space gone to our immense relief and terror. <laughs> Turns out we were forgotten by our MySpace. It seems the situation fixed itself. And a thousand years of photos and songs were all blasted off of the shelf. Guess you don't know what you have until it's over. But we didn't know it all could go so fast. So let's bow our heads and pour one out for the destruction of our past. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 